animals lead. Tell us. <laughs> Godzillas? Oh, it's you. When Zillis said there were insects, this is not what I expected. Colonel Goma, Imperial Reclamation Service. As you're answering a hollow frequency that belongs to my team, I can only assume they're all dead. We are at war. And right now, we could face a bigger threat than the Republican Empire's repetitive bickering. Despite our war, I see you've spared Lord Zillis. What will it take for you to return her to me, alive? If you tell me what you're doing here and everything you've learned since you arrived, she's free to go. I'm not entertaining this foolishness. You wasted enough of my time. Oh, and I advise turning back. You won't find what you're looking for. It's too late. Her wounds are bad. She won't make it. Not like she'd help us anyway. It doesn't matter if she helps us. She's our prisoner. How noble of you, Worm. The Republic would be so proud, except... <sighs> Cooperation from a Sith was probably too much to hope for. Keep moving. We need to figure out which way to go. I think I made it this far when I was following Malgus. Then which way do we go? Should we split up? No. Just... Just give me a minute. Here. Malgus went this way. How do you know? Because I feel his presence most strongly here. Does that mean he's nearby? Not necessarily. Remember what I said about how the terrible things that happened here left echoes in the Force? Those feelings of pain and trauma are almost like imprints. Anyone who comes through here now, even Malgus, continues to leave those imprints. And I can feel them. Why don't I sense them? Force empathy. I've experienced it for as long as I can remember. I've always been almost overwhelmed by other people's feelings and emotions. Little things like time and distance don't do much to stop it either. Does Malgus know this? Could he be manipulating these imprints, knowing that you were our only lead? I don't know. I hadn't thought about it. Well, uh, all we can do now is follow this tunnel or turn back. We go forward. But let's be careful. <laughs> 